Welcome back to the third hour today. Between emails, texts, apps, there are all kinds of ways to stay connected. But now there's one more, and this one is actually low pressure. It's the brainchild of an influence her who is trying to change the way we stay in touch. Hi there. Welcome to Marco Polo. People say so much that keeping in touch is hard. It doesn't have to be hard. It can be fun. It could be effortless. It could be easy. Vlada Bortnik is the co-founder and CEO of Marco Polo, a video chat app that launched in 2016 and has fans in Kristen Bell, Mandy Moore, and Sandra Bullock. Marco Polo is not a typical story. Vlada started the company with her husband, Nihao, while pregnant with their second daughter. The idea developed from the question, how do you bring more happiness into the world? We started digging into research, and the thing that we found consistently was how important healthy relationships are to happiness. And at the same time, he and I were so frustrated with our own experience of staying in touch with our family. So Marco Polo is all about helping people feel close. If you're in your jammies, you're ready for a bedtime story. Here's how it works. Users record a message, and the recipient can watch and respond at their convenience. Well, what do you think? Thank you for the story. The way we communicate has really changed. And now we just let social media and text do all of our relationship management for us. And as a result, there's this false sense of closeness. Hey, ladies. The beauty of Marco Polo is you just talk when you have time. Every day is a good day. Vlada immigrated from the Ukraine to Kansas City, Kansas at 11 years old. What I remember most was the trip to a grocery store, and it was such contrast to the store in Ukraine. I mean, shelves just like filled with all the produce you can possibly imagine. She went on to graduate from Northwestern University and worked as an engineer at Microsoft, where she met her husband. He and I love working together. I know it. Most people want to tell them that they think I'm a, a little crazy, but for us, it just really works. They believe working side by side sets a good example for their daughters. They see the collaboration, they see how we can get through arguments together and, you know, have it be okay. Better than screen. Since their debut, Marco Polo has been downloaded more than 10 million times. The company is still run out of their home, but has more than 30 employees scattered across the country and the globe. Nice to see all your friendly faces. They keep in touch through video meetings and, of course, Marco Polo. We started the company with this idea that we want everybody who's working at the company to work really joyfully. And working in a flexible environment is a lot more joyful than having to deal with traffic. As a female CEO, Vlada knows she's in the minority, but says she's been fortunate with a strong support system. When people ask me how I do it all, I'm very honest that I don't do it all. I don't believe in balance at all. <laughs> I really believe in being mindfully out of balance. Accepting that allows her to show her children what it means to be happy. Every day I'm literally excited and I think they see that enthusiasm and see that work doesn't have to feel like, oh, it's Monday. Bye. So when you think about Marco Polo, you probably think of the pool game, right? Yeah. Maybe Marco. the kids are obsessed with it. Well, that's actually where the name comes from. She oh. says when someone says Marco, you have to respond and say Polo. Hence, that makes sense. Marco Polo. We'll be right back.